and still on the vulnerable, government has increased the common fund for persons with disabilities from 2% to 3%, a total of 49,914 Ghana cities has therefore been dispersed to support 36 members of the PWDs in the Kasina Nankana municipality of the Upper East Region. This move forms part of the government's economic power agenda. The objective of the Persons with Disabilities PWD's 3% Common Fund is to support income-generating activities of individual PWDs, provide educational support for children, students and trainees with disabilities, and to build the capacity of organizations of persons with disabilities in the country. However, over the years, several reports have emerged that district assembly officials and some PWDs have been misappropriating the fund with impunity. Per a new policy directive from the government, persons with disabilities are to be economically empowered. In 2010, the Ghana Federation of Disability Organizations and the National Council on PWDs introduced guidelines for the disbursement and management of the fund to provide clear rules for payment to beneficiaries at a ceremony in Navrongo, the capital of the Kasina Nankana municipality in the Upper East region. The Kasina Nankana Municipal Assembly disbursed a total of 49,914 Ghana cities to 36 beneficiaries. The Kasina Nankana Municipal Coordinating Director Al Haji Abu Bakari Inusa said the checks, ranging from 500 Ghana cities to 2,000 Ghana cities received by the beneficiaries, are to help them to either start businesses undergo apprenticeship training or to support their educational expenses. What we have decided also to do is to empower the fund management committee, their uh, monitoring uh, team, to ensure that every PESWA which is collected under this fund is put for the intended purpose. Some beneficiaries, a 35-year-old Mr. Eric Batakinia and 43-year-old Madame Atiale Abara thanked government for the support and pledged to put the monies to good use. Al-Haji Abu Bakari indicated that the support package would be extended to all registered PWDs in the municipality and that a monitoring team would be constituted to periodically check and ensure that beneficiaries put the monies to their intended use.